So today I've got my lovely fiance Layla with me and she's gonna help me answer some questions for you guys to find the love of your life. Are you ready Layla? I'm ready. How do you make a woman fall in love with you? I'll speak from my perspective. Um, I, uh, the trust is one of the biggest things for me. Like when I feel like I can trust someone, they immediately start getting more and more of my attention. When I don't feel like uh, uh, they were like back in the in the day <laughs> but when they would I would catch them in little lies or um, hiding mm. the phones like even though I'm not reaching for the phone have I ever touched your phone ever never never but never. you know like when it's it's obvious that something's going on mm. then it's like immediately a little red flag so I'm starting to lose interest um, because it just doesn't seem serious I guess it's the little things little subtle things that women probably pick up more on than men and sometimes we don't even know how to explain it but it's the feelings the feeling that we will get from being with the wrong person versus the right person mm. and a lot of times especially when you're younger uh, you overlook these things because oh it's a hot person like they're hot they're hot <laughs> it's fiery it's fiery so you go for the lust versus logic and that's how a lot of um, not all, all, all of us, but a lot of us um, have these toxic relationships mm -hmm. that I guess we all have to go through these patterns to, yeah. to learn and to really uh, subtle our make, our make our senses more subtle so that we can pick up on these things later on faster. Yeah, and I totally agree with you. I think the big question or the big word that you used was the word trust. Or like, if you get a woman to really trust you, then you have the chance of falling in love with you. Yeah. Yes. Right? Like, if someone doesn't trust you, like, then it's it's like your walls are always kind of up. Right? Exactly. Um, so sometimes people will pretend to be somebody else. And I, I can, now at this age, I can see when somebody is trying to be a fake persona just to get mm. attention, which is definitely a no-no. Uh, and I can't tell you how many times, like, if I if I wasn't paying attention to that, I was like letting it slide. Like, ah, it's okay, it's fine. It wasn't fine in the end because that real persona is gonna come out eventually. And what it does, it's usually not pretty. So you want to be honest and open from the beginning and just show who you truly are. Um, so that way, you're going to attract the right people, not just in love, but in friendships and you know, etc. All of your relationships when you're honest with yourself and true to yourself. Yeah, I totally agree. And, and one thing I think also, as you were saying that, just kind of popped in my head, I think that to fall in love, to get someone to fall in love with you, you kind of also have to fall in love with the other person. Mm -hmm. I was just uh, looking at you. Oh, <laughs> that, that is right. <laughs> oh. So, <laughs> so what was the question? Yeah, I was just she was love struck by the eye. <laughs> I really was. <laughs> oh, love. You're oh, so sorry. Lovely. No, it's good. I, I'll take that anytime. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Yeah, so I think one thing, the eyes. I think one thing that really helps someone fall in love is first kind of falling in love yourself. Right, like if you're in, the, if you're open to the feeling of love. Well, just having like, confidence. If you like who you are, if you love yourself, you're going to exude that. Yeah. You're gonna have confidence in being who you truly are. Yeah. You're not gonna be hiding. Yeah. Pretending mm. to be somebody else. Yeah. Get the attention. Yeah, and I think a lot of guys, especially, are afraid of really showing themselves, mm. so they never really express love. Well, sometimes because they're kind of they, guarded, maybe. Yeah, but then if they, if they, let's say they, the girl falls for the trap. <laughs> okay, yes, there is also the girl who can fall for the trap. Exactly, like she fell for the trap. You know, she she likes the persona that he's presenting, and then they're in a relationship. Eventually, you can't be twenty four seven. That oh, person, sure. So it's going to show up one way or another. Mm -hmm. That other person that you are presenting. Mm -hmm. The real you is the gonna real is slide in. Slide. And those 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 slide ins are pretty subtle. Sometimes it's in the way you eat, in the way you do things, in, uh, the way you talk, the way you communicate. Um, when you are caught off guard. Yeah. I'm just looking at you. I'm not looking at you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but when do you feel like you?
you and I kind of fell in love. I don't want to be cheesy, but I immediately started. I was like, oh, he's so cute. But you were very funny. Mm -hmm. Like you, you were very. Um, you were just like a comedian from the beginning, and it just made me laugh. And I was just happy. I noticed that I'm kind of happy around you, mm -hmm. and that my spirit was kind of, you know, lighting, light, more, more light. More light. Yes. Oh, and I love that because I think that's what it is, right? Like you the, took the... my walls down, you know, mm -hmm. especially because you know how uh, first date, like I completely had my wall. I, I felt safe in your presence. I felt mm -hmm. like, oh, he's never gonna. He, he just doesn't. He, you just didn't strike me as somebody who would do something bad to me. And this might be like a oh, how does she know? But I just how does she know? How does she know? I felt. I just felt it because yeah. I guess after meeting. A few <laughs> bad people. You kind of smell a bad one mm. from a mile away. Your nose gets stronger. <laughs> the senses get the subtle. Senses. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you can kind of uh, feel, but it's just it, it's not even that. It's just like you felt very um, positive. You were a positive person, and I really like that. Mm. Well, thank you, babe. <laughs> well, I, I also like what we were saying earlier. I think because I was in that feeling of love right before mm -hmm. like meeting you like i'm open to the possibility of love like i'm in that light feeling it opens up the possibility where two people can fall in love with each other or being in that nice feeling right yes because i was in that as well because i'm ready for this finally mm. big love to come in yeah <laughs> so, and then he walked in <laughs> and i walked in yeah and, and was there anything last that you want to say? I don't think you should do anything extra. Just be your uh -huh. lovely self. There's nothing that you need to do extraordinary. Yes. Um, I mean, it depends on who you date. But let's say you're dating like a regular girl who is not, what do you call them? Like, well, like high end or, uh, yeah. But let's just say like a regular normal person, right? Um, I don't think you need to do anything extra other than Ooh. being yourself. Yeah. So and showing who you really are and just connecting on a human level first of all on a uh, soul to soul, mm. let that connection you know flow. Like play out. Play out. Let it yeah. play out. Yes. Don't think, try to be anything yeah. out, anything you're not. And I think we're gonna jump onto this more in the future, but I think I think trying to overplay yourself, mm -hmm. trying to overdo it, can take away from the connection. Yeah, it can be a kind of a turn off. Mm. Well, well, there you go. That's how you make a woman fall in love with you. Beautiful, thank you. <laughs> With you, it was so easy. Oh, oh gosh, making me blush. So to uh, uh, watch the next video about how to help you fall more in love with someone, go to click on this one right here. <laughs>